Greetings guys and gals and welcome to episode 12 of my Fade the Beast. Ooh, spooky. Okay guys, yep, another Feed the Beast episode. This time I'm calm, no more ranting over my internet cap. Screw them. Got new internet coming, so. Alright, first thing I want to do is uh there was a new update to this and i'm hoping it wasn't anything heavy i don't seem to be lagging in my base of wonderness i'm not okay um before we get into what i've done uh i know i didn't go over too much last episode i was more been testing you know this 1.5.2 things that they have on the feed the beast launcher I am still enjoying this one, even though I haven't been anywhere. What I'm enjoying is my frames. Um, and there's so much to do. I mean, it, there's so many machines and everything. It's so much more than what we had in the Magic World. But, I'm going to try to jump these. Because what I did in the Magic World, you know, guys who follow my, you know, episodes in the Feed the Beast. Uh, I don't want to build anything that I haven't gone over with you. Just in case you... You know, don't play Feed the Beast. You haven't seen other people play them, which I'm sure, you know, you ha probably have. But just in case, I'm covering it. So, but right now, what I want to do, and I can't scroll over on my other monitor, so I'm going to bring up this, and you guys can look at my... What? Oh, crap. Update, and I hit R. Oh, we got to change this to something. Uh, the down key, because I never use it. There you go. Stop. Stop. Oh, my... Darn inventory. Oh. But anywho. Oh yeah, you guys see I have enchanted gear. Get into that in a minute. Oh wait, yeah, get back over here. I gotta go click on my other monitor here. Okay. I want to give you a reading of the mods that are in this mod pack. Um, there's a lot of stuff I want to look up. Uh, I think some of this is new because I don't remember it. But basically what we have here is uh, the armor status HUD. Direction HUD. Um... BS, BK, or core, Reese mini map, ooh, ooh, chains, advanced machines, applied energy, er, energy, six, yeah, that, the backpack mod, bibliocraft, bladecraft, buildcraft three, additional buildcraft objects, camera craft, what the hell is camera craft? Um, the COA, or COFH core, Compact Solars, Computer Craft, Craft Guide, Damage Indicators, uh, Diamond Buckets? What the hell is Diamond Buckets? Now, that might be new. I might have to look that up. What the hell is Diamond Buckets? Ender Storage, yep. Extra Bees, Extra Biomes, yep, yep, yep. Factorization, Fancy Glass, Forestry. Oh, I love Forestry. That's my favorite mod. Forestry. Even though I've been farming the trees by hand, um, yeah, Forestry is pretty... Awesome. Forge IRC, yep. Industrial craft, inventory tweaks, we know that. Iron chest mod, hell yeah. Liquid metals. Hmm. The melod m metal allergy. Awesome. Follow, yeah, fallen meteor mod, fun. This mil million. I'm just going to spell it. Million. M I L L E N A I R E. This. What? I think what that is is like this quest thing and it affects villages and stuff like that. I hmm millionaire. What okay. Yeah, because yeah, you know, I'm super smart and, you know, got good grades in spelling. Not really. Straight A student in math. Spelling, I suck. Uh Mind Factory. Mob amputation. Oh, that would explain when I was fighting a zombie and I hit it in the arm and his arm popped off and blood went everywhere. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay, nanotech. Uh, any plugins, obviously. Uh, pet bat. Oh, you're shitting me, right? We can get a pet bat? Maybe? Is that what that... Ooh, I did not know that. This is the first time, by the way, I'm that I'm actually reading all... And I copied this onto a notepad so I can actually go look up these uh, mods and see what they do. Power converters, primitive mods, real craft, recipe remover, soul shards, and the soul shard 
is not the soul shards from the irregular feed to beast like the ultimate packs and everything it's the soul shards from like hexic the hard non cheaty freaking ones that we have to go to the end you know the end to get freaking uh, oh wait, wait 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 no we'll do bees i'm sure there's a bee that can give us end stone steve cards thermal expansion wireless redstone train craft omni tools um jammies furniture mod uh, i'm gonna murder this guy's name uh m Ibis, tube stuff dimensional anchors and micro blocks okay who got that out of the way we are done and i forgot to hit my timer so let's just hit that right now how long do you guys think that would take me freaking forever all right so all right i found this i i made some tanks um, cause I wanted to start, I didn't make like the big iron tanks yet. I, I just made these simple tanks cause I was finding a few things. I wanted to get some lava and I found this stuff. Let's use, I made a bunch of buckets. I've been burning up through iron and I'm kicking myself in the ass for that. Don't want to do that. But I came up and I found this sewage. I was mining down in my mines and I came across this like yucky brown water crap. And, uh, put that back in there. And I stepped in it, and lo and behold, uh, it caused poison damage, and it was wearing me down fast. I gotta make some shears. Oh yeah, it'll kill me. And I got this. Oh, by the way, I made this for killing cows. Uh, I made an enchanting system, which I'll show you guys. And our wrench. And our scoop for bees, because I did find a bee down there, you know, a bee's hive. And you got some rock bees. Let's go check them out. But I'll show you the mines later. The mines are boring. Um, this stuff here I want to find more of. And I haven't seen it for a while. Had a little bit in my mind. This is the uh, quarried stone. Um, still good on this stuff. Tons of it down there. Uh, but yeah, run low on this. And I've been using that in the nether. I wanted to do a uh, bright... You know, you're in the nether. It's always dark and everything. And I like the bright colors. Because it's kind of like an indicator of where you've been. So... But I'm running low on that, and I haven't found any in a while. And I've been mining out now, starting to strip mine, and mine out in all directions, and out there pretty far. Um, I'm a little low on lapis, but I've been building some things with that. that I'll get into that. All of our machines here, you can see, are missing. Um, there's our... Ah! Oh, did their wings just move? Oh, they are moving. I ought to shut that down to save some frames, but... Yeah, we found some rocky bees. Um, here's all of our mismatched stuff. I got a gas tear. <laughs> <laughs> I've been saving this rubber. It comes from the rubber trees. I didn't realize you could make torches out of that. And we have plenty of the other kind of rubber. I'll show you. This is this like... Oddball stuff. But I was burning through the iron, making buckets, and just using it for whatever. And then realized that uh, the EU machines and stuff like that require quite a bit of refined iron. Um... Still got 40 diamond. Getting a, getting a little low on there. Getting caught up in some gold and copper. A lot of this stuff we're going to need. But I have quite a bit of it being pulverized and stuff like that. So, no problem. Um, this is the new setup for this. This giant bull crap is basically to keep my pulverize running in this one furnace. Just, wow, it's overkill. And that'll change once we get better... Uh, solar panels but we need a lot of crap to do that it's expensive and there's no great tech here it's just expensive anyways which it should be i mean you can't just jump right up to you know good power without a little bit of work right yeah all right all right so um yeah see this main one's not even all the way up but these will pump up and then once we get better power this will be i'll be able to knock this out um We'll need our magma crucible down there. Actually, two for the uh, end stone. Or uh, ender pearls. If we ever get ender pearls. Oh, I hate that this is not the cheaty soul sword pack. <laughs> but, um, as you see, we've been... Ooh, got some shiny metal. But uh, we've been... Got plenty of iron now. We're getting pulverized stuff there's all kinds of weird things oh uh, by the way i was finding some of this weird stuff like this orcas so that's kind of like uh from uh skyrim and stuff but i couldn't pick it i was hitting with my diamond pick and it wouldn't pick so i had some of this 
where's the mithril yeah mithril dust i had a little bit more than that i made this mithril pick and enchanted it and apparently you need certain picks to do stuff i have to look into that i think that's part of the melody one i don't know you gotta look it up um, this is what I've been furnishing. Uh, no longer need regular stone. Actually, our barrels are starting to get full. And we need to upgrade them. So I'll show you what's behind me. But state, I've been murdering cows for books. Because, yeah, I'm back on that book thing. Kind of miss that enchantment mod from uh, Hexic. Where we could just choose our enchantments. That would be nice. But no, we're stuck doing books again. Which is no big deal. I got a... Uh... Shit. Uh, oh, a blaze. I got a blaze spawner all set up. But anyways, I, I, let me show you what this does. Uh, these are stampers. Okay, what these do is you put in a certain recipe. You got some paper down here. You put in a certain recipe here, and it makes it. Um, this one's already done, and uh, what it is is if you go across the top, it would be obsidian, TNT, obsidian, right? Yep. Then TNT, a entire block of diamond. Then TNT, yep. Then obsidian, TNT, bam. So you make it on this. Got a craft packet. Let me look up the name of these. Real, well, now hold on. Let me show you real quick the reason I want them is I want to make a wraith igniter. Okay. Um, these diamond shards so you can't click on them they don't give you a recipe but i do these are the machines that make them and that was the i had looked it up on the wiki and that was the uh it, yeah it's expensive it's a, a whole thing a diamond um someone knocking would you like to come in welcome to my home Okay, so now what you do is after you make that, you just put that, I could show you, but I should have saved the stuff and did it with you. But what you do is you you make these machines. Oh yeah, I showed you the Wraith Igniter. Let me show you the craft machines. They're real easy to build. Oh my gosh, they don't take nothing. Um, we're baby day. There's so many pages in our thing over here that it takes a while for it to update but it should have okay right here yeah the craft packet maker um that's the one machine that makes the you know out of the things like a, a piston and very easy to make and then here's the whoa now it catches up and then here's the stamper iron and stuff so these machines are very easy to make the recipes gotta look them up on wiki that's the only thing I know how to tell you. That's how I found out how to make... I could not figure out how to make those diamond shards for that uh, Wraith Igniter. And I found out how to make that permanent, which we will do because I need to upgrade those barrels. And to upgrade the barrels, we need... Let's just type in barrel. Okay, barrel upgrade. Extra dimension. And this makes them hold a shit ton. But you need this dark iron and that is the only way to get dark or to get the dark iron you need that wraith igniter because you have to take a block of iron and ignite it with that but there's a safe you got to be careful that uh wraith igniter is like a super overheat and like if you were to use it in the desert it would probably turn everything into glass and it's deadly it's the fire is just deadly but there's a way to make a certain furnace for it to kind of make it safe and pray you don't lose too many iron blocks using it. And that, we need an ender pearl, which we're going to have to go find a village and get a eye of ender trader like I do on all my guys. And what are these baron princesses? Ooh, ooh I'll check them out. But anyways, we need to get these upgrades. So I'm working on a little bit at a time, you know what I mean, to get it. So what we do is we take this, put it in here. Boom. And we get these diamond shards. So we will be able now to make, oh no, we got to go, I don't have any, actually, yeah, I do, it's in the nether. I do have, uh, what's the Wraith Igniter? Yeah. I do have, uh, oh, nether brick. I have, I have like the nether blocks and stuff because I had to, was eaten through the, uh, fort, yeah, fortresses, whatever. Okay, well, at least we got them now. That's plenty. So, let's put that in here, in here. So, 
what I want to go over with you now is the machines we need. I want to start advancing. Um, from what I've been looking at, like, I want to make, do a little bit of a menu thing here. And it's not going to catch up. We're going to have to wait. Really. Come on, baby. I mean, 40-some pages. It takes a minute. You got you got to give it that. You going up? But I want to, like, get into the next size solar panels. Let's go up here and check stuff out. Farm doing good. I really don't need these now because I've been... Are all my cows gone again? What is it with them? If we go to the nether right now, guys, it's going to be full. It's going to be full. But right now, those solar panels are just generic, easy to make solar panels that don't do nothing in the rain, the dark, very li little uh, energy output. Um, we're going to upgrade too. Haha, <laughs> alright, you're fixed. Um, we want to upgrade to these advanced solar panels. Um, reinforced glass, actually reinforced glass pretty much needs this advanced alloy and we need a compressor. So we have to make a compressor. That machine is not that hard to build. Um, matter of fact, it's right down here. It's right here, compressor. Yeah, stone, advanced or electric circuit, easy. A, a regular machine block, very easy. I mean, this stuff is made by the rubber and copper, and so very easy to make the compressor. Um, those we have. We'll just break those. And if we need to make more, no problem. Advanced circuit, no problem. Just like the other circuits, but, uh, made with lapis. Which, actually, yeah, I'm going to need more lapis, I think. And glowstone, which I kind of have quite a bit of. And redstone, but lapis, I'm a little low on. But, ah, we'll do it. We'll do it. And then, uh, wish there was, like, a simple back button. This is the killer, right here. Okay, first of all. We're going to need UU matter. We're going to have to make a mass fabricator. And, uh, and then we're going to need, like, uh, we're going to have to make a recycler. So we got to do a bunch. Um, this, we're going to need iridium. Uh, all this is pretty, you know, you guys seen it. Compressor. Um, we can make all this stuff. Uh, but we are going to need a iridium ignit. This is per advanced deal we make. And I have yet to find one of those. Those are very rare. We can make it with UU matter. Which we'll need to do because we're going to have to make. Actually, let's go back to that. I'll show you. We'll need uh, to make this this stuff here. This centurium part. This is how you make it. You need two UU matter. A glowstone. You know, so no matter what. To make the advanced solar panels, we need UU matter. And so we're going to need a mass fabricator. Let's look up that machine. See, that's what I like. Is to make that, you need this machine, that machine. Here we go. Mass fabricator. Now, actually, the mass fabricator is an energy sucker. I mean, it's going to use a lot of power. But it's not all that hard to make. Advanced machine blocks, you know what I mean? There's our compressor for the advanced alloy. This is very easy, just a machine block. You know, very simple. Um, advanced circuits, easy. Glowstone, um, the Lapatron crystal, not hard. Uh, we need a lot more lapis, and that's one thing I have tons of. So we're going to have to do some more mining, get some more lapis. Energy crystal, easy. It's one diamond surrounded by redstone. So the mass fabricator itself is cheap. But I, you know, from seeing other people's videos and everything, you know, feed the beast and everything, I know that thing will suck energy. But we only need so much UU matter. And to make UU matter, we need scrap and stuff like that. So we're going to have to make a recycler. I think that's how you get scrap. If I remember correctly, it's been a while. Come on. It's been a while. So here's the recycler. It's easy. You've got to <laughs> where there's a compressor. We're going to have to make a few of those. And then glowstone, dirt, and some refined iron. So all in all, not that difficult. But I want to start making some more, you know, some advanced... Um, solar panels but what i want to work up to and this is going to take a minute we're going to start heading to the nether that's really annoying us up there with its loud sounds and visit our 10 million cows guys i've been it's like when i go to the nether they all come back here when i'm in this world they all go to the nether which ought to be feeling pretty i, I got chickens loose in there i got got them blocked in there they're not going nowhere and I'm going to add another floor now to this and cover that and then put the farm and the tree farm up one more level. So, nether portal's fine. And 
we can actually have well if I ever go and get the soul shards I mean have we looked at the map yeah uh, yeah see there's not much to look at yet um, we do there's a building close to us if you look at it over there we gotta go check out but I have yet to be out exploring let me show you let's go to the nether I'll show you our setup here with 10 million cows this is gonna be bad maybe they'll oh, oh my god uh, move let me oh oh load oh see how bright and beautiful this is I love it would you guys go back home <laughs> all right so yeah here's all of our cows but this is not the safest path so we're gonna have to be quick I have to find out where it is but this is beautiful it's nice and bright and you can see it everywhere in the nether right. I'm gonna make a mad dash might be a shorter video but I wanted to catch you guys up um, I'm gonna get stuff you know I showed you what we need to do I'm gonna build a recycler and stuff like that and tried to protect I'm actually low on this stuff so I had to just protect as good we best we can run Doop -a -doo, doop -a -doo. oh here they come not looking just running oh shoot yep 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 we gotta get the wall oh yep 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 part us yep oh boy yep yep coming through I'm through let me low this is gonna get laggy guys this will get laggy and probably loud but I wanted to show you the setup we have here. How well it works. Um, I had some diamond swords. Made some cheapy things to kill them. This works really good. Uh, got our enchanting thing set up here. Some books. Uh, new enchanting. I don't know what that means. Um, it took me forever to get. I got a lot of stuff enchanted. Whipped up. You see what I mean by the iron chest I was getting nuts with? Alright. on the, Okay. Uh, hold on. Hold on, guys. That's, that's not going to work. Not while I'm talking. Alright. Yeah, I was going nuts on the iron chests and anvils. I stacked them on top of each other. So as I used them and they broke, I could hurry up and jump. But I kind of did this. So, you know, the efficiency five. Unbreakings. We got silk touch. We got fortune threes. This is the stuff for the sword. Um, bow. And anything armor related. I ran into that reading, and I ran into a cold touch, and I don't know what that's for. I put it on this sword. Maybe I thought it was, you know, be damaging to these guys. Not sure. Oh, and I got to fix that. I shouldn't have these particles here. Works nice, though. For the most part, it, they're like two hits. I don't want to use this sword up. But they, it works real good. It's just like my uh, survival series set it up the same way but this is all stuff that needs you know combined like the efficiency fours the threes the fortune twos getting a lot of those you know so we got sharpnesses these are all stuff that we need to add together soul stealer i think has to do with the uh, soul shards which we'll definitely be using but so here's all the stuff we need to combine this is the pumped up stuff um, yeah, see what I mean by lag? They they fall so quick that all the entities get nuts. So let's let's get away from them. Let's head back. You get a lot of entities, and if I don't sit there and kill them, now for some reason it were oh sh Jesus! For some reason there we go. Got, got our frames back. If I wasn't recording, I could sit there and do that no problem. But oh shit. But for some reason, that spawner is working better than my survival world. I don't know if it's... Mm, I don't know. But they, they protrude so fast. Excuse me, cowies. Coming through. But yeah, I want to finish this. Make this nicer. Um, I did go down here and explore. This actually drops down into... Part of that. It like wraps around. And I did my little torch on the left. So right way out. Yeah, I explored a little bit of this. Um, I need to get soul shards. That is, that's an important thing. But right now, what I need to do is go and find a village. But I need to make machines. I need to do this. And would you guys please... I gotta push them all back through and take them home. And, but after I get the next floor of our tower done. I have plans for that tower too. But what I wanted to do is 
I'll catch you guys up. You know what I mean? I've been... Let me out. Let me out. Now, see, now they're starting to come back through. But, uh, that... I don't know if leaves hurt that. But, yeah, this is a terrible layout. All temporary. Just temporary layout. But yeah, I just wanted to show you, um, I'd catch you up, tell you about the mod pack. I'm going to do a little bit of reading on this. And like I said, so far, it's not bad. Um, oh, crap, I was in the nether. Why didn't I grab some of the... Actually, I think I have some nether rack somewhere. We just got to smelt some nether rack and make that. I do need the nether brick and stuff. A safe place to make that machine, I don't know yet. <laughs> But we are going to need some dark iron, and it's it's one of those tricky machines that... Well, it's not a machine. I'm just going to build this furnace that will stay going, and <clears throat> we can take a block of iron and put it in it, and it'll turn into the dark iron, and then you can make it down into the dark iron ignits. We're not going to use too much of it. Well, actually, we will, because I want to upgrade these barrels. Right now, these barrels hold a lot. Like uh, These are full like the dirt. It holds 64 stacks of 64. Just in case, you know, I didn't have barrels in the magic world. And as you see, we're starting to fill up. Now with the mod, once we upgrade these, I think it's a ridiculous amount. I'll have to look it up. I can't remember how many stacks they hold, but I know it's a lot. But we need lapis. Mm-hmm. I got five lapis left, so. I guess I'm going to go back to the mining. And uh, I'll update you guys again. Uh, the reason I'm throwing this up again. I, did I say it was uh, still July 5th? I did put up a hexic today. So this will probably go up tomorrow. But um, right now besides hexic. I mean I could put a bunch of hexics up. Still waiting on Optifine. I think the last time I checked was earlier today. They were at 70%. They're getting there. I mean they got a lot to do so i'm still waiting to play my survival 1.6 and that i mean i could do infernal mines but i really hate not to, you know i don't want to do that without my daughter nicole and uh we've been trying to work on our new series that's coming up soon it's going to be dad and daughter not her co-commentary actually her in it uh, kind of like a little family server so but uh yeah i'm going to cut this one short i just wanted to catch you up but i am going to build the machines we were discussing anything new i do uh when i go to explore anything like that i'm gonna bring you guys into it but for most of the building and everything you know it's feed the beast and it's gonna be choppy until i find a feed the beast i want to stick with with a new computer you know i might want to go to the ultimate mod pack so but with that like again once again i wouldn't have to build the mass fabricator with you recycler compressor and machines like that so um but anyways you guys have a great day or great night that's the case might be and i'll catch you in the next episode